Peter Vaur. What a better gift. Leif, Soma says you're the man who built her longships. That's right. Each has a sharp keel, a stout mast, and a poem etched into the hull to sing the praises of the Dringer who commands her. A longship is heavy with fate. Just a few lengths of wood between you and a watery grave. What better place to put a line of poetry, hmm? Agreed. It's good to fight beside you, Leif. Likewise, Ava. Thanks again for plucking me and my warriors from the mire. Garland, is that right? That's right. You are Eivor, the infinite fighter, or forever warrior. It's a glorious name. Many thanks. You were in a tight spot when we found you. Indeed. The Saxons pursued me, ran me bloody through the swamps and into the lap of bandits. Then the wolves came. We all have our one day. The day we die. How you greet that day is all that matters. I'm proud to say that I was ready. Well, it's good to see you breathing still. You're Vienna. And you are Eivor's sunbeam. You cut through the fog like the sun burns through ice. You're in high spirits, all things considered. The ambush, losing your home. In this moment, yes. But ah, you feel that? The moment has passed. We are free to pursue the next. What a gift! It's good to have you in this fight, Vienna. I like you, Eivor. You may help me here, or step on me. And by the look of you, I'd welcome either. The day is new, and the air is bracing. Are you ready for the fight ahead? Let's take your city back. That's what I like to hear. Meet me at the western gate of Grantbridge. We've assembled there. Have care you do not enjoy taking orders from anyone but your Jarl back home. I fight for Sigurd, none else. While you're on this ship, Dag, you fight for me, and for Soma's loyalty. We fight for her. Do you see? My boy threw his heart. He hadn't... We'll make him pay the blood debt. Him and all his Saxon allies. Let's get out of here. Oh. 
One on each side of the door. Move when you get a signal and not a moment before. Wakeman must... Bridge to me, Wigmund. No more of our people need die. We may talk this out, lord to lord. <laughs> what are we to talk about? You have nothing I need. Worth by birth, even. I was born a noble. You were plucked from a giant's armpit. I built this town. From a mud hut to a thriving port. And we both know you'll bleed those ridges dry without my guiding hand. Leave! Go die in the muck where you belong, heathens! Wigman, Wigman, let's try one final time! Quit Grantbridge! And when she is mine once more, I may spare your life! Ha! I command Grantbridge! I am master here! And I will scour you rats from this land like rot from a festering wound! Let me give you some advice, old bear! The surest way to stop a wound from festering isn't with a blade. It's with fire. Come <laughs> on. 
Forever. Come face your death! Heathen eels! Wigmund is gone! He's gone! <laughs> <laughs> Plague-ridden body feed my fields. Eivor, to me. No sign of Wickmund here. He may be hiding within the city walls. Shall we search? No. He'll be gone. Count on it. Argar coward. But we've struck a bold claim today. Walk with me. I want you to sound our battle horn to announce our victory. Let all the Shire know that Grandbridge is retaken. The sound of the horn means prosperity. Long life. Bounty. Why me? Why not? You were the keystone to this attack. You turned the tide. Let the wind from your lungs breathe life back into my city.
Wigman's fading fires. But tonight, tonight, we feast as gods! My clan throws the best feasts, I think you'll find. You enjoy yourself? I did. But were you celebrating or mourning? You looked unsure. The night of the attack, I heard sounds of bloodshed coming from the Longhouse. In moments, the city was overrun with Saxons, so I called a retreat. We all have our one day, but not like that. Not that day. I've heard this before. That the Saxons appeared as if from the shadows. In all my time in Grantbridge, this tunnel was my most careful project. The best kept secret in the city. Now a hundred or more Saxons know the smell of it. The only people who knew about this tunnel were me. And the three in my inner circle. You believe you were betrayed? I know I was. By whom? That is where I hesitate. Between Leif, Galen, and Birna, I cannot say. But they are the three who helped me dig this in secret. I hoped you might lend me your wits. You are a fresh ally. I could use your eyes and ears. I promised you I'd help secure your city. That task isn't yet done, it seems. Good. I sent Galen, Leif, and Birna to destroy what remains of Wigman's power throughout the Shire. Meet with them. Raid with them. Get to know them as best as you can. Find out which of them betrayed me. I'll do what I can, but you know your warriors far better than I do. Between you and me, my heart is clouded. I love these three as if we shared a womb. I need clear, sound judgment. I need you, Eivor. You have me. Thank you. Feel free to take a look around as you wish. Search the city, the tunnel, and here, a gift, for retaking Grandbridge with us. One of the few things I have left from my blood family. Markets are up and running again. Soma doesn't waste time.
How to steer? Soma is just cursed with bad luck. Soma has only ever pleased the gods. Deserting her now, breaking your oath, that is what will bring us ill luck. Eivor, I am honored you have joined us. What's your plan here? All the Shire support Soma's ruling the city. These hamlets do not. They're feeding and outfitting Wickman's army. So we will burn their homes, quick and devastating, like the thunderclaps of Thor. How did you come to be in Soma's clan? A vision from Evolva set me on this path. It pricked my mind like a splinter, then faded. But I wanted more. For months, years, I ate only henbane, mushrooms, sacred plants, hoping to see something new. But my body dwindled. I lived addled, maddened, a wanderer, taken in by Saxons and spat out again and again until Soma found me. Naked and alone in the fence. She clothed and cared for me. Humbled as I was, I owe her my life. What do you think of the others? Leif and Birna? Leif? He's a talented sailor. If a little enthusiastic. And Birna? Well... Birna thinks of life as a grand joke. She was a smuggler when Soma pulled her from the muck, making a living on lies. Birna is part of my clan, and I will fight beside her, irreverent as she is. But she has no care for her destiny. Visions can be strange and powerful. What did you see? I was climbing a mountain, a lion and a snake upon my back, weighing me down. I struggled. And Soma appeared, and she eased my burden. When we reached the peak, there was hardly enough room to stand. On a point like the tip of a blade, we teetered there, gripping one another, tightly. I know I can seem distant, obsessed. But the gods are with us always. I see it as my duty to shelter Soma from their ire. I'm eager to start throwing torches. Now let's rid these hamlets of Wickman's rats. Light your torches and set your arrow tips ablaze, Eivor. The red enemy of the branch will make quick work of this place. upon them all leave no house unburnt this is what they get for helping rand grand bridge from soma for licking elderman whitman's boots
on you.
Smell of burning roof thatch and a heady turf fire. Now that was something. Wakeman is sure to take notice. You stamped and roared like a fiery suitor himself, marching through the flames of Muspelheim. I'll see you back home, Drenga.
on the apple cart hath fallen. These apples... Best not to draw attention here. gets longer, the nails grow, even when the corpse is cold. I've seen it. Eivor, my muscle-banded friend! There's a nest of Wigman's men just here. We're going to pick it clean. Every last one. If you lies in the bush, the less itchy the pussycat. That's how I see it. How did you come to join Zoma's army? I'd been in England for ages before Guthrum, Ivar, Uppa... Smuggling under the eyes of Saxons and Danes alike. I lied, stole, had my nose broken. Life wasn't easy, but it taught me how to bear the pain. I just laughed it away. When Soma took me in, she saw more than a smuggler in me. I was useful to something greater than myself. Useful to her vision. In a world where few saw you as worthy of trust, she's one who did. Right. And I love that about her. I love... Everything about her. You seem to bring life and spirit to this clan. Does Soma feel the same? If I knew what was going on in another person's head, I'd find life dreadful and dull. But Soma seems to enjoy my company. In what way? Her own way. Just not in the way I'd like. Painful truths are easy to bear when you can laugh, you see. Delight in the face of suffering is an act of rebellion. What do you think of Soma's other warriors? Galen and Leaf? 
Oh, Leaf's got that raw animal pull. Every time I see him, I want him to climb me like a tree and nest in my armpits. He brays about being honorable, but I've never met a man of honor who starts a fire just to be praised for putting it out. And Galen, he broods like it's an art form. He's got this self-importance that is just so charming. We could talk all day, but these Saxons may fly from their nest. You and I should take a closer look. My men will hang back and come running if things go sideways. Fighting beside you should bring a thrill. Happy I can see it up close. Don't get too close. I might black your eye or bruise your head. <laughs> You'd lose your elbow before be the bruises showed.
Odin! Slaughter. Shame about this. You fought very well, Vienna. Is that how you flirt, Eivor? Is that how I what? Easy now, Drenger. I'll see you back in Grand Bridge. <laughs> 